Burlington Industries v. Ellerth, 1988. Forcing an employee to quit is constructive discharge. In the case Burlington Industries v. Ellerth, 1988, Ellerth was effectively forced to quit her job because of sexual harassment, and this is called a constructive discharge. Many industries have made, this con made constructive discharges illegal. For example, in landlording, getting rid of a tenant by making life miserable is a constructive eviction and against the law. The company was found liable because even though they did not know, they should have known. A person who quits because of sexual harassment is suffering a constructive discharge. Multiple choice question, Burlington Industries v. Ellerth, 1988. A. Forcing an employee to quit is constructive discharge. B. Pre-employment tests must be predictive for the job. C. Quitting is on the employee and not the company's problem. D. Forcing an employee to quit is really firing the employee. Well, the best answer choice in this case for Burlington Industries v. Ellerth, 1988, from what we've been given is A. Forcing an employee to quit is constructive discharge.